In areas known for its wildland urban interface, where homes meet the forest, prevention is top of mind for firefighters now. Wildfire mitigation takes a village. Einar Jensen with South Metro helped to create a new plan for castle pines. We all have to work together. And while this is more in the public eye after the Marshall Fire, Colorado's been considered a wildland urban interface for years. South Metro worked in partnership with Castle Pines to create a 36-page plan passed by City Council last month. It's designed to assess the hazards and vulnerabilities of the city. The Marshall Fire reminded all of us once again that regardless of where you live in Colorado, you could be vulnerable to a wildfire. It reminded us that we all have a role to play. The plan breaks down what residents should do to reduce risk near their home, including first and foremost, removing juniper trees, cleaning gutters, and creating a plan for evacuation. All of the partners in your community want to help you, the resident, do better for wildfire mitigation and protecting your family. And by protecting your family, you're also going to help protect those first responders. By working together, we can reduce risk on a community level. The plan is a recommendation, not a requirement, but one the fire department hopes most residents will be open to. It takes all of us to create what we at South Metro consider a fire adapted community. As part of this plan, the fire department will work individually with homeowners as well to identify specifics that could help your home. They will also point to different financial resources for you, such as tax deductions that could help with the cost if you want to make any changes to your house to make it more fire resistant. Jenny, Steve. Just a few simple things you can do to like mitigate that risk of wildfire. Mm -hmm. I think the marsh fire just reminded everybody again how easily this can happen. Yeah, so. absolutely. Angeline, thank you.